In 1966, Hofflin and colleagues phoned up nurses in a hospital and pretended to be a doctor. They told the nurses to give a patient an unsafe level of a drug. Now, I should point out that the researchers weren't just ringing up some random nurses in a random hospital. That would be really bad and really unethical, dangerous even. They planned the study in advance with the doctors at the hospital, so there was someone ready to intervene in case the nurses actually tried to give patients the unsafe dose of medicine. Which is just as well, really, because when the person claiming to be a doctor, an authority figure, who the nurses had never met before, actually rang up and told the nurses to give the unsafe dose of medicine, 95% of nurses got the medicine from the dispensing cabinet and then went to take it to the patient to give it to them. Just as well, the researchers had arranged for someone to stop them. There's also some research by Bickman in 1974 which shows that we are more likely to follow the commands of people in uniforms. This is why when there is roadworks, they often have people controlling the traffic dressed in uniforms that look very similar to police uniforms. People are used to obeying police officers most of the time. And so when we see a traffic controller dressed like a police officer, we're more likely to slow down. We actually don't even need to dress up in a uniform. Simply wearing a suit makes people more likely to follow your commands. Advertisers will sometimes try to link their products with authority figures to take advantage of this effect. They might have actors wear white lab coats, or even actors who've been doctors in famous TV shows advocating for their product. So it's probably not a big surprise to you that authority figures are very influential and that it makes sense for us to follow the instructions of legitimate authorities. Things would get pretty chaotic if we didn't. People would be running all over the place, burning things down, stealing things, driving their cars as fast as they wanted and generally creating havoc if they didn't follow the commands given by authorities. We don't do that. Well, at least I don't, not often. The problem is that sometimes we can follow the commands of an authority figure without thinking and we might behave inappropriately or hurt someone else without meaning to.